Former U.S. Ambassador Nikki Haley has dropped out of the U.S. presidential race. Her dropping out has left Donald Trump as the sole Republican candidate for the presidential nomination. The withdrawal from the race comes after the U.S. leader scored a surprising victory over Trump in the Republican primary in the U.S. state of Vermont, her second win in the race for the White House in 2024. Among Trump's prominent primary rivals, Haley was the last candidate left standing, so her withdrawal ensures that Trump will capture the Republican nomination. My colleague uh, Vishal joins me for more on the story. Vishal, with Nikki Haley also withdrawing, it, it probably paves the way for the contest of the two political heavyweights in U.S. Uh, Trump and, and, and the elections boil down to Trump versus Biden. That is right, Rika. So, uh, soon after the victory, uh, the confidence on Donald Trump's face was quite, quite palpable. He went on to say that uh, if Biden goes on to become the U.S. president again, uh, it will be sort of an end of U.S. as a country. Big statement from Donald Trump soon after the victories. Uh, on, uh, to reply to that, Biden has said that uh, uh, Trump's intention is not good. He only wants to be the U.S. president because he has grievances. He doesn't want to serve the people of the U.S. Uh, so this comes in the backdrop of the big Super Tuesday. Uh, 14 each wins, 14 wins each for both the candidates. Uh, both of them lost one each uh, primaries. Uh, Biden lost the American Samoa primary to a little known candidate, uh, while uh, Nikki Haley swept to victory in Vermont, which is which was quite surprising. Nobody had except, expected that. So now the road lies ahead with the promises that Trump has made. So there are about right. 15 promises that. Uh, Trump Vishal, has made. who are the prominent faces who are supporting Donald Trump right now? So, uh, uh, while Nikki Haley stopped short of endorsing Trump as the, you know, front runner, uh, so whenever this, these big weeks step out of the race, they sort of, you know, uh, toe the line and they say that the biggest, uh, you know, candidate will, they, they will support the biggest candidate. But that has not happened as far as Nikki Haley is concerned. Mm -hmm. But on the other hand, there is this veteran leader, Mitch McConnell, He's the Senate uh, Republican leader. He has uh, said that he will support Trump. Uh, it, it, that, that is also quite surprising because right. Mitch McConnell had stopped speaking mm -hmm. with Trump three years ago. So out of nowhere, he has uh, you know, extended his hand. So this, has, this will come as a big boost for Trump.